Hello everyone, welcome to this OER, Open Educational Resource Tutorial. Going on with the, this course, we will show you the process to sign. In, order, in other words, recognize the merit of the author as creator of the open content. First of all, something important. We should not assume that the online content has an open license. By default, all online resources have the right to serve it unless the content has an open license. Therefore, the message is clear. It's clear. When a resource has an open license, we can reuse it, but we must consider including the merit recognition of the original author of the content. So the question is, how can we add attribution when we use the work of someone with an open license? The answer is simple. We can use the open attribution generator. We must access the following link, as you can see here, openwa openwa.org slash open attribute builder. So uh, here uh, we fill in the form with the necessary information for a well written attribution. Once this process of filling in the filling in information is finished, this tool generates an attribution that can be copied by copy paste as well as an HTML code that can be added at the website. And here you are at the bottom of this slide. An example of using the attribution generator is shown, shown on this slide. And this will be the result. And this is an important tip. You must create the attribution as you progress in the creation of your content. In this way, you do not lose track of where you found the resource to create the corresponding signature to the resource found. Now, let's look at the case study. For then, we go to the own page of openwa.org. Here, we can see at the top, in the top of the menu, a red button, Open Attribution Builder. We click on this button and we find this assistant. Now, all we have to do is fill in the fields with the corresponding data, so that the corresponding content attribution signature is automatically generated. For example, Also, we can add other fields like organization, project, but it is enough by now. Here you can see at the bottom the signature. This signature can be added to the document or to the work that you are doing. And this has been all for now. I hope this little video of OER, Open Education Resource, will help you to create the signature to all the resources you reuse when you integrate them into your learning units. Remember, please, it's too important to like if the video has been interesting for you and add your comments and questions to enrich the channel with more content. It's up to you.